All right, so we got your practice problem. So if something went wrong in that, you didn't get those answers down at the bottom, let's take a look and see if we can figure it out. So as that box was sliding down, friction was doing negative work because it was opposite the direction of the displacement, normal force was doing no work, and gravity was doing some positive work. Okay, so for the work done by friction, well remember we need to use the force of friction times the displacement, we gotta make sure they're in the parallel direction. And they are, I just have to remember there's that negative sign on the force of friction, it's sliding, so we gotta substitute, substitute, substitute. And when we do substitute, make sure we find that normal force appropriately using the y direction. So you will have to draw your free body diagram, generate your y direction equation, and solve for normal force. Once we make all those substitutions, we'll get negative 37.7 joules. Gravity, remember we need the parallel component. So not the component that's pointing into the plane, but the po component that's pointing down the plane. So that component times the displacement, both in my positive direction. So I end up with a positive 125.22 joules. Normal force, perpendicular displacement, so therefore zero joules of work done there. Total comes out to a positive 87.5 joules positive, meaning it's speeding up.